What's going on everyone? Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to help you understand everything about funded trading accounts and if you're ready for it or not. So stay tuned, sit back and let's get into it. Let me first explain what is a funded trading account. This is basically different hedge funds and financial institution that accept individual as a trader that are that are profitable. Some will have challenges for you and some will give you directly access to their trade book basically. This is becoming a new normal for traders after they learn how to trade. Their goal is to become a funded trader uh, for one of these hedge funds and start trading with the big accounts. Now I'm going to give you three steps before you're actually signing up for any of these programs and it's really important that you make sure that all of these are completely you know, set before you actually sign up for them. Step number one, are you ready for a funded trading account? A lot of people think they are ready but they're actually not and you have to understand there is no magic in having a bigger account. If you cannot really grow in a small account and you're not consistent, having a bigger account will not help you. This was proven over and over from different traders and I can promise you that if you are not consistent, you cannot grow a funded trading account. Step number two, understanding the terms and conditions. You can actually start and search for it. You will see there is a lot of different terms and conditions that will be applied when you sign up for all of these um, funded trading programs that is available out there. And if you don't really understand what are these terms, you will end up either failing the challenge or they will lock you out of their trading, um, out of your trading account simply because you couldn't follow the rules. I'm going to explain you the most important rules and conditions that I know and help you understand them as well. One, minimum trading days. That means in order for record to be verified or be accepted by these companies, you need to at least have a 10 day trading in um, the time frame that they will give you. Two, trading period. Some will give you a timeline from uh, 30 days to 60 days in order for you to complete the challenge or in order to complete the profit target, hit the target basically. Three, max daily loss. Max daily loss means maximum drawdown that you can have in a day. And that will be counted from your equity, not from your balance. That means even your running position cannot see drawdown to that certain amounts that I will set for you. This is a tricky one because sometimes you are not even seeing it because for example, you're doing some stuff and your trade is running and if it pass that percentage, you're out. Four, max loss limit. This is basically when your challenge is over or even if you are a funded trader, they will lock you out of your account and you are no longer their trader. And that's usually set to 10% of your um, balance. Five, max lot size. This one is also a tricky one because when they set a max lot size for you, that's usually on overall of your trades running and you cannot have anything over that lot size open. You can choose to have multiple position or one, but the overall lot size cannot pass that certain amounts that you're supposed to go. Six, profit target. This is an easy one. The moment you hit this target that usually is 10%, you will get to the next one, which is profit share. Seven, profit share. Profit share is basically the percentage that you will take from the profit that you made and the rest would be for the uh, funded program. And that's also somewhere from 70 to 30. There is a uh, 50, 50 as well and it's variable depending on which uh, funded program you work with. Step number three, finding the right company to work with. There's so many companies out there that are accepting different uh, retail trader, but currently there is two of them that are leading in this business, one of them being FTMO and the other one being Audacity. And I'm going to explain 
to you everything about both of them and what it takes for you to become a funded trader and then the choice is yours to see which one is suitable for you. In the FTMO, you have to pass two different challenges. The first one will call a challenge. The second one is a verification. And only after you pass these two challenges, you will get a funded account. And after you pass that profit target as well, you will see profit share. And also the fee that you paid to become their trader will be refunded. Let's quickly review the terms and conditions for FTMO. As you can see, you are having a minimum trading day as well as a trading period for yourself on both of the challenges. And also you will have a max daily loss on both of them. You have no risk parameter. Your profit is 10% for the challenge, 5% for the verification, and the profit share is 70, 30, and you will take the 70%. You can sign up for accounts as low as $10,000 up to $100,000 and you can choose to be an aggressive trader or a normal risk and that will change the fee as well as the risk parameter, max daily loss and profit target as well for you. Now let's go over Audacity. In Audacity, there is no challenge that you need to pass and that saves you all the time that you have to waste on the FTMO in order to become a funded trader and then see profit. And also, you will start trading your live account right at the beginning. You also don't have a max daily loss in Audacity. That means you can be worry free about if the drawdown passed the same percentage or something. And as long as you don't hit the max loss limit, which is 10%, you're good to go. There is a maximum lot size and also you cannot sign up for the amount of the trading accounts that you like. It starts with $15,000 and if you prove yourself, they will increase that account balance every time you hit your profit target of 10%. What they will do is they'll give you the profit share and double your trading accounts at the same time. That means by the time that you're passing challenges on FTMO and trying to make profit after two challenge, on the Audacity, you will see profit three times plus your account is sitting at $120,000, which is a really hard thing to do if you have a $10,000 account in the FTMO and after passing all those challenges, now you're sitting at a $10,000, not $100,000. One of the other benefits of Audacity is not having to pay any commission or swap. And that helps you when you are taking a trade, especially if you are a scalper, you will not have to be worried about the commission. Also, the spreads are really good, which also I know a lot of people have problem with um, FTMO and their spreads, especially on session changeovers. The fees for the Audacity is not refundable. That means you have to pay the £199 at the beginning plus a $99 monthly fee for the first month. And after that, you will have to keep paying £99. You get access directly to the liquidity provider and that's why you don't pay any commission or swap and the spreads are great. If you compare these two trading environments together, you will see that you don't have a max lot size in FTMO. That means you will be paying a lot of commission because you are able to open multiple lot size. And in Audacity, you don't have that commission at all. Also, if you take one trade at the same time in these two platforms and trade move one or two pip in your favor, you will see that you are blue in Audacity, but you're still red in FTMO. That will make your way to pass these challenges harder. And I'm afraid some of these companies are not in the business of helping you grow, but they are in business of selling a demo account. So you need to be careful who you're dealing with. The profit share is 50-50 and you will receive it the moment that you hit your profit target. Plus you will see your account will be doubled in less than one hour. That's it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new. Let me know what you think in the comments and if you have any experience with any of these two or any other funded program, let me know and let's discuss in the comments. 
Also, if you are interested in getting more information about Audacity, feel free to click the link below in my description and one of the Audacity managers will call you as soon as you sign up with. Thank you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.